How's it going, my friend? This is Anakis and San doing a review for Thrillin' 30 Dreadwind. He is a modernized version of the Gen 2 character. He was in this purple and big teal. Light, light blue. Uh, I figure it's kind of frustrating to get into back and forth from robot mode to vehicle mode. But, uh, really doesn't look bad. The purple, the, the red, and the what would be the windows, silver the chest, and behind the shoulders. Just all around, nice detailing on the figure. The colors are nice. See the baldrin right here in the shoulder. A pin joint, allows for good motive, 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 ah, movement, bend at the elbow, and it like this, but that's when you do a transformation, head can, doesn't move very well, there's light piping which is nice, there's no waist articulation, there's light can go up that far, the back that far, Bend his knee and I get some hooks. Chest, there we go. Blue out here. I'm saying there's a pin joint in the knee or bend and the foot can move. Can the can be detached ceiling. And uh I'm gonna be honest, the pegs for both sides of his arms, or you can hold it like that. We'll come back to this later. To transform him. Bend at the knee. Hold that piece in right there. Hold the feet in. And just peg 
right into play. Show that again. Pull the feet, rotate. a couple times. It's easy for you to transform. Works very well. I think the color seems a lot better than the Megatron version. You got the Gen 2 Decepticon symbol right there and there, which is a nice touch. It's a nice little update. I would have maybe liked to see this as a Voyager class. That would have been nice. But, it is what it is. A lot of the Voyager, some of the Throne 30 weren't the greatest. So, it is what it is. were really good. Get him back into his robot mode.